here we are in the park, not in the within the four walls of our home. We ventured outside of our home and back in the park again, Stoner Park, and here's Kendall right behind me. But also there's one other human here today. Hello. Welcome to the park. We're staying apart, we have masks on, I think we're gonna be okay. Uh, at least we're not one of the 150 people playing soccer without masks on. I'm gonna form my own team and give them all deals. The Rustic Inn, the holy grail of buffalo wings in Los Angeles. So happy they're still open for takeout wings. So we're gonna get some and uh, try to go hit up a park somewhere with a view, drink a couple beers. Let's see. Thank you. Probably the worst light to be sitting in because we're like right in shadow slash direct sunlight. But maybe you can see us. But we're about to eat these wings. This, this here is your more standard buffalo. Extremely hard to find on the west coast actually. Um, on the east coast every bar has tons of really, really good wings. Uh, but on the west coast, not the case. Not the case at all. Everybody tries to make them super fancy. So if you're in, the, if you're in LA and you're looking for really good wings, you rustic in. Haven't had them in a while. Extra crispy. Okay, so we're right next to the Greek theater. I'm gonna try to send the drone up. Get some shots of the uh, the empty theater here. Let's see if this works. There we go. I'm still learning a little bit about the drone, but hope you enjoyed those shots of Greek the, the Greek theater. Huge bummer that we couldn't go there this summer. I've seen a lot of great concerts there. One of the favorite summer activities is hanging out at the Greek theater, and that'll have to do for now, I guess. Anyway, let's go. All right, everybody. We're going to Idlewild. Got some sandwiches here. It's two sixty nine. It's pretty cheap. Pretty good. We're in the small town of Banning, California. And uh, behind us, the mountain there. It's about a 45 minute drive up, and then we'll be in Idlewild. Fun fact about Idlewild, um, the mayor of Idlewild is an elected dog. The mayor is a, uh, is a golden retriever. I thought I was being super clever by setting the camera up on the base of a tree there to get a shot of us walking up. What I didn't notice is that 
I put it directly in an anthill. So my camera was covered with ants. And sort of a situation where it's like, what the hell do I do? So I tried to brush them off as best I could, but now I think there's ants all over us. <laughs> they didn't seem to be fire ants. I did get bit a couple times, but it didn't really hurt. So I guess we lucked out on that one. Cross. As ready as I'll ever be. Woo. I think he likes that. You did it. Woo. All right, we successfully traversed. Uh, the river that everyone said we wouldn't be able to tra traverse. <laughs> that river is notorious for people getting swept away, never to be seen or heard from again. This is to all the haters who said we'd never make it. Yeah, these are to the haters. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I'm gonna do a little acorn whistling demonstration. I have these two little acorn toppers. There you go. Little acorn whistling hack. A little wilderness hack for you. <laughs> Everybody likes the hacks. Just uh, nice to hang out and just hear the rush of the, the white water. Whitewater Rapids. The Whitewater Rapids. Just, um, we didn't bring our life vests, but... We should have, though, because it almost turned into, like, a Kevin Bacon situation. It did, yeah. The River Wild. Or the other one. Or the other one. Right, Whitewater Summer. Or, uh... Interpret it as you will. Whichever yeah. Kevin Bacon movie applies. We're here in Idlewild at Humber Park, and we did the Ernie Whatever Trail. It's very nice. Easy parking. Memorial Day. We needed to get out, and this was a nice little, nice little way to do it. And now we're sitting here in the parking lot. It's great. Yeah. It's a nice little parking lot. Nice parking lot.